Carry on, chill. <laughs> but of course, you, you get deliveries to your home now. Imagine 200 years ago, you had to get oh, well, travel along the old droves to the market to get your stuff, didn't you? Here we are, beautiful church. When I first came here, I thought it was like paradise here. I still do. Hills up there, look. Hills up that. Old farm buildings. And the lovely bench that I'm going to sit on now. I'm going to sit on this bench and cool down. But look at that view. We've made it here. I will check the time. I imagine I've written it's at least two hours gone past. And there's the church. And the door is open. Always welcome. Don't sit on that, Shill. Oh, look at that. So this is Sheila. Compton Bishop. I've cycled here before, don't forget. It could have been that I cycled here first when I found this place. The days, that was about when I started cycling again in 2010, so you're talking about 13 years ago, I might have first come across the church. Or I might have deliberately been looking for it for Cousin Barbara in Canada, who's got Wookiee ancestry, ancestry and other people, other names. When I sat here, it wouldn't have been exactly this time of year, it was usually the summer though, and I sat here in total peace, and I thought this was a really, really beautiful place. I still do. I'll be going back down that way and up the windy track on the way back, by the way. Camera down a minute. This is Sheila. Here I am. Compton Bishop. Big heavy rucksack full of water and food. First aid kit. Right, I'm going to turn you off for a minute, camera. Here we go, St Andrews, Compton Bishop, I've got this on the very early camera that I had, I took the pictures and did a video in here, in about 2010-ish I think the first one was. See, they've got a William at Oak. You used to spell Oak, O-K-E in the past, you see. Yeah, I used to. Oh, it's lovely and cool in here. Great big, I wonder if that's been carved out of one piece of stone. Like I said, I've videoed this really thoroughly over the years. The little tubby font for baptisms. I probably got one of these anyway. I'll have another one though. It's always handy to have more than one. So I misplace them. Just, we're not having a massive visit here. Just a little visit. Because we have done it before. And I've done it with Sony videos. 
Sony camera, so it'd be really good quality. This is just really a browse, not a detailed. People want to see the detailed one, they can go on YouTube and find it. I don't need to keep doing the details every single time. Oh, another great big Bible. Sometimes you can find these in charity shops, you know. These big Bibles. They got them in Burr Green, where my ancestors were baptised for over 500 years. Yeah, I've got some really good views of this when the sun was coming right through the glass. I remember that. Hello, St Andrews. Is Sheila visiting again? Oh, look at that. A oh, little dove. Sweet sort of things are I'd make. The lectern. No prayer today. And the thing. They never have the facilities open in this these places. Very, I find very few churches do. They want people to visit, but you know you've got to walk quite a way to get here, and there's no way in to use the facilities. You know, so I just took a few pictures. We're only on a brief visit brief today. Little. Walk around the churchyard. I've come all the way to visit this place, so... Look at that lovely scene, look. I've got to get right up there, yeah? The last time I did it, I went up, followed a path, went up through there. Yeah, that's the way I went. Today I'm going up that way. Now what I, what I remember actually when I came here last, I got a feeling the Wookiee graves had disappeared. Um, I don't know if they took them up. I don't know if they were here. I'd have to find the old video. But there were Wookiee graves here. And what I remember is I couldn't find them. So I was wondering whether they'd been moved. Look at that. I've stood right on top of there, by the way, in the past, last year. Been right up there. That was a lovely walk, mind. That was just a local one going round. Yeah, I'm sure that the Wookiee graves were somewhere around here. Ah, here we are. I found it this time. In memory of Alan Charles Wookie, died the 6th of January 1945, aged 71. Yes, they are here. I wonder how I could have missed that last time. This could be another one. And on this side we've got Bessie Parker Wookie, died the 22nd of June 1954, aged 79. And this, this could have been one as well. Oh, I'm glad I found it again. I'm just going to take a picture. It's getting a yeah. bit cast over, but I don't mind. It's actually cooler. I'm not going to moan about it. As long as it doesn't thunder, I'm all right. Yeah, I'm not staying long, I'm going to go down. <sighs> Just having a quick look. I might try and get out that gate. 
There's the St Andrew's flag flying, look. Up there. Right then, I think goodbye um, again. I probably won't be here for another year. Um, I'd like to, but I can't drive here anymore. I can camp cycle. So, after being another year, I've got lots of places to visit. Thank you, though. Let me just walk up here a minute. Just get a few images of the church on this side. Looks like there's a tile missing from the roof there. I think this is a car park. Oh yeah, there's a van there. Some people park and then go walking, you see. Yeah, I've got to get right up there. I've got to go up there. Or up there. Either way. But I thought I'd go that way today. Yeah. There's not a gate over there, is there? I can't get through over there, can I? I've got a feeling I've got to go that way in a minute. I don't think there's a gate though. Right. Over and out. I'm just going to take a picture.